Hello dear students, I am Ajay Karmarkar. Before starting further, I would like to say something. Please watch video completely. Sit with copy pane. If you find somewhere important, pause the video, note it and proceed further. Although you have facing any problem or difficulties, then please write in comment box. I will definitely solve your problem. And along with, please like, share and subscribe my channel that can reach more and more students. Thank you. Now, here is the question is, a parallel plate capacitor having plates area S and plate separation D, small d, has capacitance C1 in air when two dielectrics of different relative permittivities epsilon 1 equal to 2 and epsilon 2 equal to 4 are introduced between the two plates as according to the figure. The capacitance becomes C2. The ratio C2 is to C1 is option first 6 by 5, option B 5 by 3, option C 7 by 5, option D 7 by 3. This question is asked advance 2015. Here is the key point of this question is only utilization of a combination of the capacitance. How to use of parallel combination and series combination, all these things we have to use in, in this question. Here you have given two parallel plate which having the area of the plate is S and the distance between the two plates is small d. And some part, you can see that some part is fill up with different dielectric values epsilon 2 is equal to 4 and epsilon 1 equal to 2 so remaining part so here we can draw a separate diagram you can see that the distance is made d by 2 and epsilon 2 this is epsilon 1 okay and its value is 4 its value is 2 so, we can see that the upper part, upper part in series and remaining part, this is the remaining part, its epsilon, permittivity is epsilon 1 is equal to 2 and area is S by 2, distance here taken D and here distance is D by 2. So, in parallel diagram, it can understand by like this one, okay. So here, these two capacitors as in series and the third one is in parallel, okay? Here we have to take these two capacitors given the name is C3 and C4, okay? Because C1 and C2, C1 is in air and C2 is whole combination given that name is C2. So therefore, we have to take in here name is C3 and C4. Okay, it is in parallel. Then what is the formula to solving the capacitance uh, parallel series combination? Then C3, C4, C3 plus C4. So now, what is C3? Here, the permittivity is epsilon 1 and it's epsilon 2. Its uh, area of the plate is S by 2 and the distance is D by 2. And same things here is also the area of S by 2 and distance of the plates D by 2. Now substitute this value <coughs> here epsilon naught, epsilon 1, S by 2 and D by 2. This is C3 and epsilon naught, epsilon 2, S by 2, D by 2 upon C3, epsilon naught epsilon 1 s by 2 d by 2 plus epsilon naught epsilon 2 s by 2 and d by 2. Here you can see that 2 2 cancel out 2 2 cancel out this is 2 cancel out. Now epsilon naught square and s square epsilon 1 epsilon 2 and d square. Here in denominator you can see that epsilon naught 
S and D get common. Only epsilon 1 and epsilon 2 is remaining in bracket. Here 1D cancel out, 1S cancel out, 1 epsilon cancel out. So now remaining epsilon naught, epsilon 1, epsilon 2, and here 1D is remaining epsilon 1 and epsilon 2. Okay, and S here S 1S is remaining. So now capacitance C34 overall epsilon naught S and D. And here the value of epsilon 1 is 2 into 4 and uh, 2 plus 4. This is C1. We have already written initially. It is C1 and 4 to the 8 and it is a 6. 2 3 the 6 to 4 the 8. Then C3 4 equal to 4 C1 by 3. Okay. Now, remaining portion, this remaining part is in total value is a, we can take C5. What is C5? C5 is epsilon 1, epsilon naught, total distance you have taken D and area is S by 2. So therefore, here it can be written as 2, S by 2. So whole system is in parallel, it means it can be written as C5 epsilon s and d here epsilon 1 and 2 it means this is c1 and epsilon 1 means uh, 2 and 2 to cancel out c5 is a c1 okay and now whole system is in parallel because initially we have already discussed about that here c3 4 and this is 5 so this is in series and this is whole system is in parallel. So now total capacitance total capacitance equal to C34 plus C5 and its value is 4 by 3 C1 plus C1 then 7 by 3 C1. And whole capacitance is already given that C2. So now overall answer C2 by C1 is 7 by 3. So D option is correct answer. Okay. I hope so. You understand this question. Thank you for staying till the end of this video. And yes, don't forget to subscribe my channel. Thank you. Take care. Bye-bye.